had some developments today that surprised a few people, namely the introduction of Vasco Thompson. He's a convicted kidnapper. And one team, Casey says, talked to George Anthony on the phone the day before Kelly was reported missing. West 2's Kendra A. Strike is live in our newsroom tonight. And Kendra, how is the defense connecting Thompson to this case? Well, Martha, at this point, the defense is only connecting the ex-con and George Anthony by cell phone records, claiming the two called or text four times back in July of 2008. Right now, Casey's attorneys don't even know if there truly is any way to tie Vasco Thompson to Kaylee's murder. My client has no idea who this person is. He's never talked to him. Attorney Mark Littman says his client, George Anthony, has never had anything to do with this man, convicted kidnapper Vasco Thompson, who spent a decade behind bars since the crime in 1987. Casey's defense argues that their own investigators recently discovered this witness was connected to George through cell phone records, showing an exchange of calls or texts between the two on July 14th, 2008, a day before Kaylee was reported missing. And I imagine Mr. Uh, Vasco Thompson is going to say he has never met my client before uh, and has no idea why the defense is deciding to bring him in. Unfortunately for Casey Anthony, this is something her attorneys should have investigated thoroughly three years ago. Defense attorney Richard Hornsby says the judge may allow Team Casey to depose the surprise witness to see if Thompson talked to George. But Hornsby believes it'll take more than a possible wrong number to get the con allowed on the stand. It makes for a great, um, a great whodunit because if you're trying to get rid of a, of a body, what better person to contact than a convicted felon who's engaged in violent crimes such as kidnapping? You can't just stick somebody on the stand and say, you've been convicted of kidnapping and, and you called George Anthony, so therefore that means George Anthony hired you. Do you know George Anthony, sir? Thompson wouldn't talk to us. Littman says like other allegations lodged by the defense, George will deny he had anything to do with Kaylee's death. Uh, obviously anguish, um, there's plenty of sorrow, and uh, there's a, a bit of anger uh, towards the defense. For Attorneys say now three weeks into the trial, it's unlikely Judge Perry will allow what could be perceived as an ambush witness to testify. Live in the newsroom, Kendra A. Strike, West 2 News.